Okay, let's convert rate into unit rates here. So, how do we convert rate into unit rate? Well, the unit rate always has a de denominator of 1. So, we convert rate into unit rate by dividing the numerator by the denominator and maintaining the units of measurements. So, we have unit rate, and we're going to round to the third decimal place. We have Noah hits 152 home runs and 225 at-bats. Uh, the rate will be 152 home runs in the numerator and 225 at-bats in the denominator. So we have here a rate. Now let's convert this by using simple, simple uh, long division into a unit rate. So how many times does... 225 go into 152 it's impossible so we're going we're going to convert our 152 into 1520 let's place this decimal point here right next to the two on the right side and copy the the decimal point on the quotient side and borrow a zero so 225 goes into 1520 roughly around six times six right on top of the newly borrowed zero here staying organized six times 225 gives us 1350 and then we could begin here subtraction so 0 minus 0 is 0 this 2 is going to become a 12 12 minus 5 gives us 7 we're gonna borrow from the 5 making it a 4 4 minus 3 is 1 and 1 minus 1 is 0 so now we're left with 170 Let's borrow another zero here and drop down our newly borrowed zero, making our 170 into a 1,700. So 225 goes into 1,700, roughly around seven times. So now we have seven times 225. That'll give us 1,575. Uh, let's make convert the 0 into a 10. Okay. This 0 is going to cross out, converting it into a 9. And we're ultimately going to borrow from the 7, dropping it down to a 6. So 10 minus 5, well, that'll give us 5. 9 minus 7 will give us 2. 6 minus 5 gives us 1, and 1 minus 1 gives us 0, and we drop, we'll drop down the next 0, just for fun. We're going to have to borrow another 0, since we're going to round to the third place value here, decimal place value, uh, come Converting our 125 into a 1,250. How many times does 225 go into 1,250? Roughly around five times. Let's clean up here just a touch. Um, and then we're going to multiply 5 by 250. 25 here so we've got the 5 down and we can stay here that 225 times 5 gives us 1125 1, excuse me let's begin subtraction we have 1250 minus 1125 and that'll give us 125 okay at this point now we can just simply round up 
because uh, we can notice that there's just going to be a sequence of five here. So our quotient here is 675 thousandths. So the unit rate here is 0.676 thousandths home run at bat. batting average the unit rate is point six hundred seventy six thousandths home run at bat so he's got roughly around like sixty eight percent chance of hitting a home run every time he's at bat